Hi everyone, welcome back to another video. So for today's topic, I wanted to discuss the small and light program that Amazon offers. So you're probably familiar with the FBA program. Basically with the FBA program, Amazon will ship and pack your orders directly to the customer. There are so many perks associated with this program. First, you don't have to do the picking and packing yourself and don't have to worry any of the logistics. Amazon will handle all of that for you. And of course, not having to worry about space for your inventory. Amazon has their own warehouse in which they will store all your inventory for you um, but the one con associated with that is they're gonna be charging you a fee for their service basically they'll be charging you a storage fee a shipping fee and of course a referral fee for using their FBA program however it's very much worth it but for some people it's eating up at their profit margins however that's why I wanted to bring up the topic of the small and light program because basically the small and light program will help reduce your cost significantly if you are eligible to meet the requirements in order to be accepted Accepted into this program. So let's talk more about the small and light program and how it can benefit you and to see if you qualify as well. So what is the small and light program? Basically, it's a program that Amazon offers that's intended for small and fast moving products. So products that qualify for this program will have reduced fees for their Amazon business. So as we know with FBA fees, it's based on weight and size. So the larger the product and the more space it takes up, you're gonna be paying more in FBA fees. The purpose of the program is basically to reward sellers who have small and lightweight items because they are taking up less space and of course they're high in sales velocity as well. In addition to small and light, there are some notable perks associated with this program. The first perk is free delivery. Basically, Amazon will offer free delivery up to three to five days for Prime members, and for non-Prime members, they will receive delivery between six to eight days. This is a great incentive for shoppers because they know they will be receiving their product at a reasonable time. The second perk is A to Z guarantee. Basically, if anything happens with your Amazon order or with a customer's order, Amazon will make sure to handle that properly so that the customer receives their order or is satisfied. And then the third perk is promotions. Basically, Amazon will cover any discounts for eligible products. So if your product is priced under $5, it's likely that Amazon will have a promotion in which if you buy two of that particular product, then the customer can receive 5% off, all covered by Amazon. Now that we know what the small and size program is and its purpose, let's talk about some of the requirements that need to be met in order to be eligible for this program. So I've also included the list right here if you want a visual representation of the requirements requirements, but let's also go over this list together. So for the first requirement, we can see in order to be eligible for the small standard tier, we have to have the product at a size of 15 by 12.75 inches. So, and that's all the standard tier. And then for the second requirement, we can see that in order to be qualified for the large tier, your product has to be between a size of 18 by 14 by 8 inches or less. And then for the third requirement, we can see that a maximum weight of 12 ounces is needed for the product. So if your product is over 12 ounces, it likely will not qualify for the small and light program. And then for a fourth requirement, we can see that a maximum of six ounces to qualify for the slowest small and light fees within your tier. Also, the product has to be in new condition. You cannot sell an old product or you will not be qualified where, for this program. The listing has to be enlisted on Amazon for at least 90 days. Um, you had to have 25 sales in the last four weeks. So Amazon will basically be using your last four weeks data to see if your product has traction. And if it has made the more than 25 sales, Amazon can see that this product has traction and that you will be qualified for the small and light program. And the last requirement is it must have an Amazon barcode. So how do I get started with the small and light program? So basically your first step is to create an Amazon seller account, enter all your information, and then you'll be registered for a seller account. Next is to find a product that you want to select for your selling journey. If you want to make sure that you're choosing a product that fits the small and light program standards, you can use the AMZ Scout FBA calculator tool to make sure that your product is meeting size requirements and weight requirements. Let's take a look at how we can do this together. All right, everyone, let's go ahead and show you guys how to use the AMZ Amazon FBA calculator to determine if a product might be small and light eligible. So as you guys can see, I'm on my desktop. So the first thing we want to do is download the Amazon FBA calculator extension. It is free. So definitely download that. 
So as you guys can see, I have already downloaded this extension within my browser. All right, now let's go on to a potential product that we might be interested selling on Amazon. So as you guys can see, let's just use a candle for example. So I'm interested in putting this candle on Amazon and there might be some you know, possibility that this candle might be eligible for small and light since it is a small tier product. All right, so what I wanna do is pull up my extension. So as you can see, my extension is right here. So the next thing I'm gonna click is run AMZ Scout Calculator. So I already clicked on that and we have all this information pop up as a result. So the best thing about this calculator, we're gonna have a bunch of data and measurements pop up. And so when we see on our um, right hand side of our screen, we can see the product weight, the product size, the package weight and package size. So we're getting all these measurements for this particular product. This is great information for us because if we're set, uh, selling a very similar product, um, that we can figure out all the packaging size and the product weight with this FBA calculator. And so using this information right here, we can determine if this product will be eligible for small and light program. So highly recommend getting this extension. It's gonna give you all the insight you need to determine if a potential product that you are gonna be selling is eligible for small and light. And you can kind of pretty much assume that you will have reduced Amazon FBA fees and will have a higher product margin as a result. So hopefully this was super helpful and I highly recommend this extension. Again, it's free and it's just gonna give you a lot of insight that's gonna be super helpful for all the potential products you're thinking of selling. Alrighty guys, now that you have verified your potential product for small and light, now what we're gonna do is enroll in the FBA program. Basically, if you don't have any products within your Seller Central, you're gonna click on add products and then you'll be given the option to either do Merchant Fulfilled or FBA Fulfillment. Just make sure to click on FBA Fulfillment so those products can be within the FBA program. If you already have products within your Seller Central but they're Merchant Fulfilled, it's really easy. Just go to Inventory and then there'll be a little um, arrow selection in which you can update that product to FBA. It's really simple um, and you can go ahead and change that to the FBA fulfillment method rather than fulfilled by merchant. All right, when that is done, when you're done with, you know, enrolling your products into the FBA program, next you're going to want to enroll them into the small and light program. We're going to go into our seller central again and basically what we're going to do is click on the growth tab and then click on fulfillment. After that, you're going to make sure that you are in the small and light program. You're going to select small and light. And then after that, you're going to click on quick enroll and you're going to enter the product SKUs of which of the products you want to be eligible for small and light. After that, you're going to submit and see if they are, you know, meeting the eligibility requirements for small and light. Pretty simple. You just got to copy the SKUs, paste those SKUs, and then go ahead and see if the system will register those particular SKUs as small and light eligible. Alrighty guys, so that concludes the end of our video. I hope you got a better understanding of the small and light program and hopefully you can get some practical use out of this program to lower your product costs for your Amazon FBA business. Definitely take advantage of it if you are eligible and you're gonna see a difference in your sales and your revenue because you are lowering those costs drastically. Alrighty guys, I will see you guys in the next video. Thanks again for watching and wishing you the very best of luck with everything in your journey.